All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. We're over here at uh, Volkswagen right here on Katy Freeway looking at this 2007-2008 uh, Honda Element SC. Um, I'm noticing a lot of little dings like this right now, which is not bad. Still has the original wheels. According to the uh, Carfax, I don't think that it had any uh, major accidents or anything. Uh, this is normal on these SCs, so if you see this, don't freak out. You could always change it and put a cover on there. The seats look pretty good. They took out the original mats. These are aftermarket mats. That kind of sucks. Um, and it looks like, uh, it looks like this door's been painted actually, just from looking at it right off the top. We'll see right now. Um, the back right here. Uh, yep, the back uh, mat is gone too. Maybe they took it off here at the dealer uh, just to clean it out. But yeah, that one. It, these are definitely not original. All the books are there. It's got wheel locks. The interior smells pretty good. It doesn't smell bad or anything. It doesn't smell like it's been abused. Here's a decal right there. You want to look for these right there. And you want to look for them on every single piece of the element. Every door panel, everything should have it. You see that right there? That's why I'm saying I don't see the decal here. So it could be maybe the door was replaced or repainted. Uh, you would definitely want to look for stuff like that. It gives you signals that maybe the car was taken to a body shop and wasn't reported. Um, and you could probably see a little difference here in color. There's a big difference in color. As you can see right here, this panel is way darker than these. So maybe something happened to it on this side. I'm not really sure what. Um, the headlights, the headlights still have the uh, original markings. They're right there. You could still, you could, yeah, right there, it's Honda. So that one's original for sure. This one here, it also has the Honda, so that's good. And uh, you could see the color. You see that big difference? right there all these colors kind of match uh, so I don't know there's one right there yeah you see this one has it here um, I need to find the uh, sticker for this door oh there it is right there so that's that sticker right there we'll go back and look at the other one Let's see. mileage it's got 161 not bad at all if you look at it um, they want about 79 for it I think that's what they want for this one Everything works. Let's see what it sounds like. Sounds good. Um, sounds like a Honda Element to me. Doesn't sound any weird or different. We're going to pop the hood. Go check out the front end and stickers. But yeah. So if you're looking for an SE, this is an 0708. Here's the uh, information right here. This is a... Uh, yep, 161,000. And there it is right there. It's a 2007, so I just sold my 2007, so that's not bad. So that's what we got right now. Let's go look under the hood. A little tape on the seal. That's kind of normal, honestly. All right, there it is right there. Sticker there, sticker there, bumper, hood, motor sounds good. Still pretty decent, everything looks good, no weird noises. I definitely want to see if there's a VIN number on this door. Yep, there's a VIN right there, you can see it. Definitely something happened to this door though. Maybe it wasn't replaced, but it definitely was repainted. And you could tell because of the way this right here. I don't really feel any lines, so it could have been the whole door. I don't know. Um, that's kind of sketchy, though. That big difference in color, it's usually not normal. That, that's just my opinion. I don't know. I could be mistaken, though. Just, But if anybody's looking at this element, just know there's a big, big difference in panels. That's a lot. Yeah, see. Tail lights are still, I think they're original. That's Stanley. Yes, that's an original tail light. Oh, look, it's got the uh, element cover. That's pretty cool. Tailgate. Let's look for rust. There's definitely no rust here. It's pretty good. And then uh, spare tire looks good. Look, this thing has a little button. So rare to see this on these used elements. 
this is really cool though the way this works right here you just extend it out uh, it's awesome really nice surprised to see that there a lot of them they usually take them out and they lose them there's definitely no rust on it let's look at the bottom holy look at that that's beautiful not a single bit of rust this thing is amazing uh, if they didn't want 79 for it I would take it in a heartbeat but it's a little too much for this car for me especially since I like using them making content and then I resell them uh, it would be really hard to make anything off of it that's just me but if you're looking for a good element look at this thing this thing is so dry it's clean let's look at the other side original cat dang look at this this thing is so so nice just looking at this bottom that that kind of lets you know how well taken care of this element is even if it has blemishes on the inside it's not bad at all just think about it that way one little leak right there on that that you know the VTEC valve that little cover so whenever you do that you change that cover you change your tensioner uh, your pulley and then you do your main seal that's usually what I do and that way you can prevent a lot of problems but man this thing looks clean sounds clean a lot of original parts Huh? Oh no, it's nice. Definitely. AC blows really nice and cold, guys. Anyways, um, like I said, this is a very nice element. So if you're looking for one, definitely it's a good deal. It's right here at uh, West Houston Subaru Volkswagen. Come check it out. It's definitely a good lick as far as uh, elements go. And really the only big blemish is this. And I'm a little concerned about the paint on the other side, but I don't think it shows any accidents. I think it's just, I think, uh, I have to look, but uh, I'll, I'll put the link in there and then y'all can check it out. But if you're looking for a nice SE, something with decent miles, this is a decent price car. $7,900 is usually what this car will go for. So it's a, it's a really good deal and it sounds really good. I'm not really sure how many keys it come, but uh, as far as paint and body, definitely very clean. So yeah, guys, uh, very nice car. Anyways, all right, thanks for watching. Stay in your element. And uh, we're going to be uh, element hunting uh, a couple uh, elements today. So you'll see a couple videos uploaded pretty soon. Just because uh, I'm in the market for another one. So I'm definitely looking for my next buy. This is a very good deal for the price. So just keep that in mind. All right, guys, stay in your element. Be good.